Continuing on into the third fortress here, we could prep with the P-Wing if we wanted to, but you're greeted with the spike ceiling and these roto discs, which will prevent you from flying. So I'm going to use my suit to get these out of the way, and I'm going to get a running start, and I'm going to fly up and show you a hidden platform up here with a 1-Up. Now after I get this one up, I could continue just to jump and fly over to the right to cover some more ground, but instead I'm going to lure these ghosts as far up as possible and go straight down where I left off just to show you more of the floor plan. Guess I'm just a glutton for punishment with this game sometimes, but I do want to show you everything I can. So we are going to get past this treadmill here. And if you listen, whenever you have one of these power-ups, like there's a leaf that was just underneath me there, you will get the opportunity to fly. And flying in this level will help you get past some things. Like right here, you get a running flying start, and you can get up over that thwomp and the roto disc with the treadmill. That is a deadly combination below me there. But once again, I am going to go down and show you how to traverse it here. So we are going to get this rotodisc out of the way <clears throat> and once we do so the treadmill will constantly be pushing you back and you just have to try to fight it and inch forward to trigger the thwomp and then you have to get a running start to get past him. I'm telling you, it's easier just to fly up and over and get away from that stuff. Now with the treadmill running against it, something that I've noticed is it will ramp up your ability to fly if you wanted to fly up and over that way to get to those blocks or if you want to try to use it to build up your flying ability to get past this one part that is to our right here with these stretches and the spike strips below you with the roto disc i'm telling you it's really hard so i'm going to show you that you can run back and forth and bounce off the walls it's not perfect um it takes a really long time but if you can get it just right, you will be able to fly up and over these stretches and the pit, the rotor disc. You can just bypass every bit of this. Just be patient, bounce back and forth off the walls. And as you can see there, I was able to fly over every one of those obstacles. Now, this final trap here is laid with these boos. I'm walking back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, not to present my back to either one of them. And then once I do, I'm gonna lure them where I can jump over them and get to the door. Now, finally, we are in Boom Boom's trailer. I think I've been calling him Bam Bam in some of my other videos, but the wiki said it's Boom Boom, so we're gonna go with that. You jump on his head three times and you're done. Now here, I'm just gonna wait and watch his timing, and there we go. So, didn't wanna lose my Tanuki suit, so I took my time with him and we got past it. That's been the third fortress and the final obstacle between you and the airship to save the day on World 6. Thank you guys for watching. Please hit that like button and subscribe if you haven't done so.